Hello, my name is Jill Moore. I am the Star City Middle School art teacher. I've been here for 14 years. The most influential person on my whole life is Miss Nikki Owens. I went to Woodlawn and when I was in the second grade, Miss Nikki came and she taught me art until I was a senior. And I went to college and I finally decided that I wanted to do exactly what Miss Nikki did. Um, I cannot feel those shoes. Miss Nikki is a hard worker and Woodlawn is so lucky to have had her over the years. Everyone who's had Miss Nikki is lucky. She is the most kind, gentle person. She's so sweet and so creative. And I am so happy that I got the chance to have Miss Nikki be my teacher. And even though I graduated high school 20 years ago, I still stayed close to Miss Nikki. I love coming to art conference because she's always here and I get to spend time with her. Um, and her daughter is an art teacher as well. And so is my sister who had Miss Nikki. So she's been a gigantic influence on all of our lives and we are definitely lucky to have her. I am Angela Laporte, Director of Art Education at the University of Arkansas in Fayetteville. It is my pleasure to congratulate my dear colleague, friend, amazing educator and scholar, Dr. Injung Yoon Ramirez, the 2021 recipient of the Arkansas Higher Education Art Educator of the Year Award. You have been a devoted leader and transformational educator who has empowered many through art education. Since you joined our faculty in 2017, you have shown a deep commitment to art education in and outside of our state, to colleagues, students, teachers, and members of our local community. You work diligently with me to develop and implement major revisions to our undergraduate BFA in art education program that now offers two concentrations in K through 12 teaching and community practice. You initiated the Art Education in Action virtual lecture series recently, inviting art teachers from across the country to present on how they bridge social justice theory to practice with innovative approaches to curriculum and student empowerment. You also collaborated with art education colleagues, local K-12 educators and leaders in community arts organizations with arts-led integration. And you, your expertise on culturally responsive teaching through art and the development of an arts-led integration website has positively impacted collaborations with educators in art and other disciplines. As founder of Interweave in 2018, a program that provides bilingual classes and workshops for adults and families in and outside of Northwest Arkansas, you promoted bilingual language competencies and empowered immigrant communities through in-person and virtual modes. In my experience observing your community program and reading your publications, I realize the extent to which you have been transforming people's lives in a very personal and meaningful way through art education. You've taken on many administrative roles over the past four years that required extensive time and effort. You served as program head while I was on sabbatical, field experience coordinator, and undergraduate program coordinator. I could always depend on you regardless of leadership roles or any daunting task. 
your expansive contributions to art education in higher education and beyond provide evidence of why you are most deserving of this award. Congratulations, Injung. Hi there, I'm the current Arkansas Art Educators President. My name is Charity McCartney and I nominated Stacy Glover for Arkansas Art Educator of the Year. Stacy is the epitome of Arkansas Art Educators Association. She was the president and the past president and is the knower of all things. All presidents since Stacy has been president, go to Stacy. She put together our website. She has kept us in a tax-free exempt status. And she is just the knower of all things Arkansas art educators. And Stacy, you're so deserving of this award. I'm so proud of you. And I have more questions for you. And so will the next president. Thank you for your service. You're awesome.